Hello learners, welcome to Business Analytics Made Easy. In this video, we will learn about data frames in R with the help of an example. A data frame is a two-dimensional data structure which can store data in a tabular format. Data frames have rows and columns. Each column can be different vector and different vectors can be of different data type. Before we learn about the data frames, let us have a look into the R vector. So we can make use of data.frame function to create a data frame. The syntax goes like this. So here I have created a vector called a data frame one. And in that we are going to save this data.frame function and open the bracket. The first column I have created with values C of value one, two, three, etc comma second column name c of again the value 1 2 3 etc comma third column c of values 1 2 3 etc and if you are going to create the fourth column also here you can type the fourth name of the fourth column and then c of the value 1 2 3 etc so here the values should be equal number of values also you have to create here so here i have created three columns so I have included three values. So if you are creating four columns, then you should enter the four columns here. So the reason is the data frame should be in a rectangular format. The data frame can contain different types of data types. So here, if you see uh, in this given example, the first column has um, um, string variables and the second column also string variables. Third and fourth column has numeric variables. So data frame can contain multiple data types, but the number of values and the number of row and column should be equal. So let us have a, a look into the example. I created a vector called data underscore frame and the syntax starts here data dot frame and the first column I want to have the name is subject C of mathematics, physics and chemistry comma. The second column name is names. So it is C of Ram, Rahu, Radha, etc. And uh, I'm going to store their test marks. In test one, they scored 99, 89, 80 respectively. And in test two, they, uh, they have uh, scored 100, 95, 86 respectively and close this. Let me execute this. So while, you are, we, are exe so while you are, we are executing the program, we have to select the whole uh, syntax. So it's just a one line syntax. Um, due to the space constraint, uh, it has been created in multiple lines, but it all are same code. Let me run this. So here my data frame is created and it is stored in the vector called data underscore frame. To print the data frame, we use this um, uh, vector to be typed. It is data underscore frame. This is that uh, vector I have created. Then run that so you can see the output in the console so it is data underscore frame it has been printed here it is subject names their test one score and test two score so you we can understand that data frame has um two dimensional data structure it is, it is in two dimension and also we are storing the data in tabular format that is also the feature of a data frame and it has rows and columns. Yes, it has rows and columns. Rows are um, the subject names and their uh, marks code. And different vectors are also created. So string as well as the numeric vector is created under the uh, data frame. Thank you.